Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, we're thrilled to have you join our community. To all our returning viewers, welcome back and thank you for your continued support. Your presence means the world to us. Today, we're diving into a truly fascinating and spiritually enriching topic. The signs that your guardian angel is communicating with you. Have you ever wondered if that sudden feeling of peace, a feather found in an unexpected place, or a vivid dream was more than just a coincidence? These experiences could be your guardian angel trying to get your attention and offer guidance, comfort, or protection. In this video, we'll explore 11 signs that you might have overlooked, all inspired by the wisdom and teachings of Saint Pio of Pietrelcina, affectionately known as Padre Pio. Known for his deep spiritual insights and close relationship with his guardian angel, Saint Pio provides us with profound understanding and examples of how angels interact with us in our daily lives. Have you ever felt a sudden peace in a troubling moment? Or perhaps you've noticed repeating numbers that seem too meaningful to be random. Feel free to share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below. We encourage you to engage with us and with each other. Your stories and experiences could be a source of inspiration and affirmation for others. So, grab a cup of coffee or tea, find a comfortable spot, and let's dive deep into the beautiful and mysterious ways our guardian angels communicate with us. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel for more spiritually enriching content, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Now, let's get started. Sign 1. A Sudden Feeling of Peace Have you ever been in the midst of chaos and suddenly felt an overwhelming sense of peace wash over you? This might be a sign from your guardian angel. According to Saint Pio, peace is one of the surest signs of the presence of God's messengers. This feeling of tranquility, especially during troubling times, can be a reminder of God's love and protection. The Bible tells us in Philippians 4 verse 7, in the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. So, when you feel unexpectedly calm, take it as a comforting nudge from your guardian angel. This sense of peace isn't just a fleeting emotion. It's a profound inner serenity that defies external circumstances. Saint Pio often emphasized the importance of trusting in God's providence, which naturally brings peace. He once said, pray, hope, and don't worry. Worry is useless. God is merciful and will hear your prayer. This reassurance aligns perfectly with the sensation of peace you might feel, reminding you that your guardian angel is close by, guiding, and protecting you. This inner calm can also inspire you to face your challenges with renewed faith and courage, knowing that divine assistance is ever-present. Sign 2. Unexpected help in times of need. Have you ever found yourself in a difficult situation and suddenly, out of nowhere, help arrives? This could be your guardian angel at work. Saint Pio experienced such divine assistance many times in his life and believed that angels are always ready to help us in our time of need. In Hebrews 13 verse 2, we are reminded, do not forget to show hospitality to strangers, for by so doing some people have shown hospitality to angels without knowing it. These unexpected acts of kindness are often more than mere coincidences. Saint Pio taught that God sends his angels to intervene and assist us in tangible ways. He encouraged the faithful to be aware of these moments of grace and to give thanks. Reflecting on these instances, you might realize that what seemed like luck or chance was actually divine intervention. Your guardian angel may be working behind the scenes, orchestrating events to ensure you receive the help you need just when you need it most. This recognition can deepen your trust in divine providence and encourage you to be attentive to God's subtle guidance in your daily life. Sign 3. Hearing a voice when alone. Have you ever heard a gentle voice calling your name when you were alone? This could be your guardian angel trying to communicate with you. Saint Pio often spoke of the ways angels make their presence known to us, and hearing a soft, inner voice is one of them. The Bible mentions in 1 Kings 19 verse 12 that God sometimes speaks in a gentle whisper, and this can be true of his angels as well. These moments are usually subtle and can be easy to dismiss. However, they often carry a sense of urgency or importance that lingers. Saint Pio himself experienced such divine communications and urged believers to be attentive and discerning. 
He said, The Holy Spirit, who is the soul of your soul, knows your thoughts and desires. He is guiding you. So, when you hear that unexpected voice, it's worth pausing and reflecting on what message your guardian angel might be conveying. These gentle whispers can offer guidance, warning, or reassurance, encouraging you to trust in the spiritual guidance you receive. Sign 4. Finding Feathers in Unusual Places Have you come across a feather in an unexpected place? This is a classic sign that your guardian angel is near. Feathers have long been associated with angels, symbolizing their gentle and protective nature. Saint Pio believed in the subtle signs that angels leave to remind us of their presence. Psalm 91 verse 11 says, For he will command his angels concerning you to guard you in all your ways. Finding a feather can be a tangible reminder of this divine protection. When you find a feather, especially in an unusual or meaningful location, take it as a personal sign from your guardian angel. Saint Pio taught that these small miracles are God's way of reassuring us of his constant care. He often spoke of the importance of being aware of the divine in the everyday moments of life. So, next time you find a feather, let it remind you of your guardian angel's love and vigilance. These moments can inspire you to maintain a sense of wonder and gratitude for the small, yet profound, ways God communicates his presence and care. Sign 5. A feeling of being touched when alone. Have you ever felt a gentle touch when no one else was around? This could be your guardian angel's way of comforting you. Saint Pio had many experiences where he felt the physical presence of his guardian angel, especially in times of need. In Matthew 18 verse 10, Jesus says, See that you do not despise one of these little ones. For I tell you that their angels in heaven always see the face of my Father in heaven. This verse highlights the close connection we have with our guardian angels. Feeling a touch when alone can be a profound experience, offering comfort and reassurance. Saint Pio taught that our guardian angels are always close, ready to offer support and guidance. This physical sensation can be a gentle reminder of their presence, encouraging us to trust in their protection and care. It's a beautiful, tangible way for your guardian angel to show you that you are never truly alone. This comforting touch can also remind you of the constant companionship and support provided by the spiritual realm, encouraging you to remain steadfast in your faith. Sign 6. Sudden Changes in Temperature Have you ever felt a sudden change in temperature, like a warm or cool breeze, without any apparent reason? This could be a sign from your guardian angel. Saint Pio often spoke about the ways angels make their presence felt, and changes in temperature are one of those subtle signs. The Bible tells us in Psalm 104 verse 4, He makes winds his messengers, flames of fire his servants. This imagery reminds us that angels can interact with the physical world in mysterious ways. These temperature shifts can be particularly noticeable during prayer or moments of reflection. Saint Pio believed that such experiences were indications of divine presence and activity. He encouraged believers to remain open to these subtle signs, as they are reminders of the spiritual realm's closeness to our daily lives. So, when you notice an unexpected change in temperature, consider it a gentle touch from your guardian angel, reminding you of their constant watch over you. This awareness can deepen your sense of connection to the divine and encourage you to be more attuned to the spiritual signals around you. Sign 7. Seeing Repeating Numbers Do you often notice repeating numbers, like 1111 or 222? This could be your guardian angel trying to get your attention. Saint Pio, though not specifically mentioning repeating numbers, spoke of the importance of being aware of divine signs in our daily lives. Numbers can be a way for angels to communicate messages from God. In the Bible, numbers often carry significant meaning, such as the number 7 symbolizing completeness and perfection, Genesis 2 verses 2 to 3. Seeing repeating numbers can be a prompt to pay attention to your thoughts and prayers. Saint Pio encouraged mindfulness and attentiveness to the divine in all aspects of life. He believed that God and his angels are constantly communicating with us, often in ways we might overlook. So, the next time you see repeating numbers, pause and reflect on what message your guardian angel might be sending you. These patterns can serve as reminders to align your actions with your spiritual beliefs and to trust in the divine timing of your life's events. Sign 8. Vivid Dreams with Clear Messages 
Have you ever had a vivid dream with a clear and uplifting message? This might be your guardian angel communicating with you. St. Pio was known for his powerful dreams and visions, which he believed were ways God and his angels communicated with him. In the Bible, Joseph received divine messages through dreams, Matthew 1 verses 20 to 21, showing that God often uses this medium to guide and protect us. These dreams are usually more vivid and memorable than regular dreams, leaving a lasting impression. St. Pio taught that such experiences should be taken seriously and reflected upon, as they often contain guidance or reassurance from the divine. If you have a dream that feels particularly meaningful, consider it a sign from your guardian angel, encouraging you to pay attention to the message and seek God's guidance. These divine dreams can provide clarity and direction in your life, encouraging you to follow the path that aligns with God's will. Sign 9. Unexplained Fragrances Have you ever smelled a pleasant fragrance without any apparent source? This could be a sign of your guardian angel's presence. St. Pio experienced the scent of roses, which he attributed to the presence of his guardian angel and the Virgin Mary. The Bible speaks of the prayers of the saints rising like incense before God, Revelation 5 verse 8, linking pleasant fragrances with the divine. These unexplained scents often appear during prayer or moments of deep reflection, offering comfort and reassurance. St. Pio taught that such experiences are signs of divine favor and presence. If you encounter a pleasant fragrance without an obvious source, take it as a gentle reminder of your guardian angel's presence, bringing you peace and encouragement in your spiritual journey. These moments can enhance your sense of the sacred, reminding you of the holiness and love that surrounds you in your daily life. Sign 10. Finding Coins Have you ever found coins in unexpected places? This could be your guardian angel leaving you a sign. While St. Pio did not specifically mention finding coins, he spoke of the importance of recognizing small signs of God's providence in our lives. In Luke 12 verses 6-7, Jesus reminds us of God's care for even the smallest details. Are not five sparrows sold for two pennies? Yet not one of them is forgotten by God. Indeed, the very hairs of your head are all numbered. Don't be afraid. You are worth more than many sparrows. Finding a coin can be a simple yet profound reminder of God's care and provision. St. Pio believed that nothing happens by chance and that every moment is filled with God's presence. So, when you find a coin, take it as a sign that your guardian angel is reminding you of God's constant care and attention to your needs. This simple discovery can serve as a reminder to trust in God's provision and to remain grateful for the small blessings in life. Sign 11. Feeling a Presence During Prayer Have you ever felt a strong presence around you during prayer? This could be your guardian angel joining you in your spiritual practice. St. Pio often spoke of the profound sense of companionship he felt from his guardian angel, especially during prayer. In Matthew 18 verse 20, Jesus says, For where two or three gather in my name, there am I with them. This promise of divine presence extends to our guardian angels as well. Feeling a presence during prayer can be deeply comforting and affirming. St. Pio taught that our guardian angels are always with us, supporting us in our spiritual journey. This sensation of being accompanied is a beautiful reminder that you are never alone in your faith. Your guardian angel is always by your side, offering guidance and intercession as you draw closer to God. This comforting presence can deepen your prayer experience and reinforce your connection with the divine, encouraging you to continue seeking God's guidance in all aspects of your life. Thank you so much for joining us today as we explore the 11 signs your guardian angel might be communicating with you. We hope you found this video enlightening and that it brings you closer to understanding the divine presence in your life. Remember, our guardian angels are always with us, guiding, protecting, and comforting us in ways we might not always notice. Before you go, we encourage you to share your experiences in the comments below. Have you noticed any of these signs in your life? We'd love to hear from you. And if you found this video helpful, please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing to our channel for more insightful content inspired by the wisdom of St. Pio and Christian teachings. Now, here are three practical steps you can start implementing today to deepen your connection with your guardian angel. 1. Daily Prayer for Angelic Guidance Step 1. Set aside a quiet time each day, even if it's just 5 minutes, to connect with your guardian angel through prayer. Step 2. 
Begin your prayer by thanking God for His protection and for sending His angels to watch over you. Step 3. Ask your guardian angel to guide you throughout the day, to help you notice their signs, and to protect you from harm. 2. Creating a peaceful space. Step 1. Choose a small area in your home to dedicate as a peaceful space for prayer and reflection. Step 2. Add comforting elements such as a candle, a small cross, or a picture of a saint like St. Pio. Step 3. Spend a few minutes each day in this space, allowing yourself to feel the presence of your guardian angel and the peace that comes with it. 3. Journaling Angelic Signs Step 1. Start a journal to document any signs you believe may be from your guardian angel. Step 2. Each day, write down any unusual occurrences, feelings of peace, or moments of divine intervention you experience. Step 3. Reflect on these entries regularly to help you become more aware of your guardian angel's presence and guidance in your life. These simple practices can help you cultivate a deeper spiritual connection and awareness of your guardian angel's loving presence. Thank you for watching, and may God bless you abundantly on your journey of faith. See you on our next video.